Hello again everyone, my name is Yogdog and welcome to another episode of Imperator Rome. In this one, I've been doing a little bit of thinking and I think I'm actually going to move east now. I'm going to try and take large chunks of Egypt. So in order to achieve that, I'm going to need to make sure I move all of my legions over. Ready to actually go into combat. So. The Ptolemaic Kingdom has Macedonian as its primary culture and Hellenic as its religion. It has 10,793 pops, of which not far off 2,000 of them are Hellenic Macedonians. Um, so it's struggling with culture, but it's doing fine for religion by the looks of things. Do, 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 do. Yeah, <coughs> Hellnick is doing just fine over in Egypt. I do not need to construct a northern fleet. So what does Stonehenge give out of interest? Uh, Omen power, a pair of local research points and local noble output. Cool. Don't mind if we do. Okay. Uh, I do need to fabricate a claim here. Let's go for Bithynia Inferioris. Import some grain over on Crete to avoid any more issues with uh, any more issues with starvation in the region. So I think we're going to go after Egypt, and then we're going to go after Libertania, try and take as much of Iberia as possible. So, uh, once the city status is done, I need to build a forum and a great temple, which is easy enough to do. Yeah, we lost a lot of buildings over here when it was conquered by the Roman rebels. So I have quite a few wonders now, including a couple of ones we built. Do -do -do. Ah, another military tradition. Let's go for planes combat bonus, and that completely finishes Roman traditions. So next up is just making sure to get Italic tribe traditions fully done. Legio Magna Grecia is going to push into Cyrenica from our African holdings. Legio Cisalpine Gaul. <coughs> I 
think. Ah, that's where the Egyptian fleet is. Right, let's make a landing over here. In Greece, just so I can make sure to. Uh, what was it? It was, uh, was it a great temple? Great temple in a forum. There we go. Uh, we're going to make our landing in Greece because I want to make sure all my troops have full food ready for an independent operation into. over into Egypt. find some march east. I need you to take Kyrene. I feel like I need another force over here. Only Joseph's Alpine Court uh, goal will be able to deal with a good chunk of stuff, but not everything. that sorted. Right, my fleet should be able to deal with the Atomic Kingdom's navy. I just need to catch it out. Let's go for harassment, I think. Close ranks would be good at some stage. All right, let's go to war. All right, for import routes, I think I'm just going to go for some more grain. Nine hundred people, we can assault that. Triplex ACs would be good at some stage. I think we'll just stick with shock action. Okay, huge damage done to the Egyptian fleet there. Importing amber, you say. Let's change that. Oh, I already have enough amber. In which case, let's cancel one of the trade routes. Oh, no, I'm not importing enough. 
range. Oh, soul sword, no. Probably just going to take the Egyptian heart ones and as much of North Africa here as possible. Time to launch your salts. Another siege ends in our favour. Bites of dust. Ah, they knocked me back here. Looks like they took some heavy losses in the process, though. Major Macedonia, and it's going to get Trepida. Well, of armies, minus 15%. Well, that's not good. Seems to me that their numbers are starting to make the difference here. You get over here. Right, well, it needs to be dealt with. Okay, cohorts, that's going to give us some additional disappointment. Let's retreat to the other side of this fort. I think I'm gonna perform a couple of divine sacrifices here because I want my loyal uh, stability, not loyalty, uh, to go up. And we're gonna go try to lead the siege here. I'm actually gonna go for additional disappointment here. seem to have met their match. Time to retreat. I 
I think we need to pull out here. Our legions have been absolutely battered and they need to go reinforce. I will make another landing here, but I'm going to send more troops. I got any more legions I can build, which are decently sized. Illyria is not too bad. Legio Illyria is going to move over to help out over here. and destroyed that uh, formation of Egyptian troops, which is good. Almost hired mercenaries by accident then. That would have been bad. The right, Persian Kingdom actually has some areas over here under its control. Interesting. Okay, Frace can also have a legion. Legion of Frace. So their sieges are ending in their favour here. Right, Legion of Greece is almost ready. Unfortunately, we taken Alexandria. Okay, everyone is ready to go. Make a second landing over. I should probably destroy this mercenary group first. Alexandria. My right, oracle can be improved. So conquering traditions four. Uh, logistics four. Military training traditions four. X 
Pickaxe und Roman Empire, the entire Roman Empire would get national population grow, freeman happiness, slave happiness. Yeah, please. That sounds great. It seems to be their mercenaries which are causing us so many problems here. Uh. Heavy infantry offense, defense, maintenance costs all improved. All pretty helpful. I was gonna get this northern fleet out of the way and then move it to help out. Okay, we have once again taken that capital. Kyrene has also fallen. to deal with some of these mercenary groups. So priority now is going to be chasing them down before they cause me too many more problems. Divide and conquer. Oh, it's Heteroi. Where are you? Heavy cavalry morale increase. The other ones don't really matter. Pretty damn helpful. Now we need to besiege again. Ah. Okay, let's go chase you down as well then. Egypt is asking for peace a lot here. Get it, bro. Our numbers will tell in this particular battle. This is Alpine Gaul, shows its worth. Keep getting more and more awards, which is excellent. Uh, at one point, it looked like they were going to give us a good run of our money here. They did pretty well, all things considered. 
thanks to all the mercenaries they were able to hire, but since then it's kind of gone a bit rough for them. Cancel some of these. Because we need grain. More food required. I need popularity, legitimacy, stability, and we're close to all of those. Even with our reinforcements, I'm not able to do too much, right? Where are they going to try and run to now? The fort I really want to fall is here. With that, they can't just keep sending troops around and avoiding their own forts. Okay, there will be another battle taking place in Kyrene. completely annihilated. is going to end in our favour fairly soon. Needs to be careful about this one here though. That's fine, we'll just chase him off. Oh, doing it again. Let's go chase him off over in the north. This is going to severely weaken them. We are unfortunately defeated up top there. It's a good chunk of AE.
Well, this is going to kneecap the Egyptians. Quite heavily. So, Roman Empire is going to continue to expand. In fact, uh, no, you should go in charge. As should you and you. And then, let's go put some more uh, researchers in charge who actually have the relevant traits. went pretty well this one. It's up to 26,275 pops now. I think uh, what we're gonna do next is complete our conquest of Britain because I believe our truce will have run out by now. Yeah. And then afterwards, it's going to be Iberia. Oh, I really need to work this AE off first. So, we're going to go to an appeasing stance for a bit. Well, I'm not going to be getting 70 stability right now, alas. Which I need in order to be able to pass Divinity Statute. Although actually I can't because he doesn't have 8 zeal due to dementia. Drat. Well, there goes my plan. However, uh, it's inconsequential. At the end of the day, I can deal with the AE pretty quickly at the minute, thanks to all the techs we have, the innovations, I mean. So, uh, our next plan to conquest Britannia, then Iberia, and then probably like fully secure the rest of the med. Let's see if we can do it within a, a decent time frame. However, thank you very much for watching this episode everyone. Really appreciate you watching this series of Imperator to Rome. Um, trying to decide what I'm going to be doing after this one. I'm leaning towards playing as a smaller nation and just taking the islands in the Mediterranean and helping other nations to expand. See what I can do there. We'll see you though. Uh, thank you for watching and I will see you next time.